Well, hello there, good people. Hi, I'm Jason with Green Country Agroforestry, and today I'm getting ready to do something with all of these sweet potatoes. I'm going to start slips. Go away. Nobody likes you. Okay, so the idea is we take a tub, something like this, we fill it with potting soil, not all the way up, about eh, a third of the way up, moisten it slightly, and then we take our potatoes. These are some of the small ones that uh, were secondary. You know, the vines grew out, they rooted, and they, they produced smaller potatoes further away from the center of the vine. We put these down here into the moistened potting soil and then cover them loosely with a little bit more soil. We just keep the mixture slightly moistened and warm, obviously, and in a short amount of time, they should begin to develop little vines. Let me show you an example of a potato that's already got some. Oy. Have a look at this. Develop little vines from the potato. And in that potty mix, they will develop roots here. Once the roots develop, we take the vine and slip it off of the root. And we have a potato slip. It's basically a started potato vine with its own root system. And that's what we're going to try to do. Incidentally, this is a store-bought sweet potato. It's not a seed sweet potato. It's not one that I saved from last year. The rest of those back behind me are ones that I saved from last year. But this one came from the grocery store. And uh, I'm going to get it started for my Can I Plant That series. Obviously, I think this one's going to work, folks. All right. I need to go and really quickly get some more of those little plastic tubs. I can pick them up at the dollar store for a dollar each, and uh, I'll be right back with you. Now we've got a water added in there. we got a consistency that's just short of mud. So we drop a little bit in the bottom of our container here. And there's still, still play ball. should be about enough, about one third of the way full. All right, I'm going to start off with our store-bought potato, which is already starting to develop the vine. We want the vine to develop roots, though, so we can slip those off. Hence, slip, potato slip, slip, sweet potato slip. I'm going to put that in there. And we're going to have them joined by a couple of these small potatoes that popped up the secondary potatoes last year. All right, so we got those spread out a bit. I'm just going to get a little bit soil packed in around them. Okay. There you go. Just barely enough. Just barely enough to cover. So those little potatoes can start to develop roots. Well, all right, good people. That's how we go about getting our potato slips started. I hope you found the video informative and or entertaining. And if you did, well, you know what to do. You know what to do. I'll catch you next time.